Primary biliary cirrhosis is an autoimmune disease of the liver, which is characterized by immune destruction of small bile ducts in the portal triads. Risk factors for primary biliary cirrhosis are other autoimmune disorders, 80% of cases. sjogren sicka syndrome most common, rheumatoid arthritis, progressive systemic sclerosis. Other associations, idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis, systemic lupus erythematosus. And other autoimmune disorders. Mechanism is mitochondrial proteins trigger CD8 T-cell, destruction of intralobular bile duct epithelium. Causes non-casseating granulomas are present in 25% of cases. Difference between primary biliary cirrhosis and primary sclerosing cholangitis is that primary biliary cirrhosis leads to the destruction of intrahepatic ductules by T-cells. Primary sclerosing cholangitis constricts extrahepatic and intrahepatic ducts. Primary biliary cirrhosis more commonly occurs in women, greater than 90% of cases, between 40 and 50 years of age. A slow, progressive destruction of the small bile ducts of the liver, causing bile and other toxins to build up in the liver, a condition called cholestasis. Further slow damage to the liver tissue can lead to scarring, fibrosis, and eventually cirrhosis. Increased risk of ulcerative colitis in 70% to 80%. Increased risk for developing hepatocellular carcinoma. Clinical findings include tiredness, itching, pruritus, itchy skin, 20% to 70% of cases. Pruritus is of unknown etiology, it is not the deposition of bile salts in the skin. Early finding that occurs well before jaundice appears. Painful hepatosplenomegaly. Jaundice, 60% of cases, late finding after most of the bile ducts have been destroyed. Inflammatory arthropathy. Xanthalasma, cholesterol deposited in the eyelids, 40% of cases, Kaiserfleischer ring in the cornea, caused by the retention of copper similar to that. Seen in Wilson's disease. May develop lymphocytic or fibrosing alveolitis. In the blood antimitochondrial I'm antibodies positive 95% to 98% of cases. Positive serum ana. Increased serum alkaline phosphatase and gamma glutamyltransferase. Increased serum cholesterol. Cholesterol is a component of bile. Treatment. Ursodeoxycholic acid, UDCA, marketed as ursodiol. Obeticholic acid is approved for patients with an inadequate response to UDCA. Liver transplantation improves survival. As in all liver diseases, consumption of alcohol should be restricted or eliminated. Parameters in evaluating response to UDCA are ALP and total bilirubin. After liver transplant, the recurrence of disease rate may be as high as 18% at 5 years, and up to 30% at 10 years.